All right. It is time for our Atomy Vision guest speaker, Martin Hahn. So please give Martin Hahn a big round of applause. If you guys don't know me, my name is Martin Hahn. I'm currently a Sharon Rose Master in Atomy, and I live in North Carolina. How are you guys doing today? Is there even gathered together on a Saturday? Man, I, I remember when I was always on a Saturday too, going to meetings and actually going to the hotel rooms. But now we're always on the Zoom meetings. And I miss the traveling. I miss all this thing. So if you guys haven't been into hotels for the seminars before, my gosh, you're missing a good, a good thing. Or <laughs> you're missing out a lot. So hope, hopefully eventually we can try and get this thing together. Um, let me just share my screen here. All right. Let me just get with my experience. For those of us who haven't heard it, here you go. All right, so before uh, Atomy, I was never really big an entrepreneur. I wasn't like, you know what, I'm gonna do business when I get out, when I start, you know, after college or try to, you know, own my shop or try to do get rich quick or nothing like that. I just was a college student and I had, I started to gain symptoms like these allergies. Uh, I had uh, pollen allergies. I had, you know, every single year I would sneeze like crazy. My eyes would get all watery. Back in high school, I actually kind of started in high school, I think. In high school, that's when I, I uh, was in marching band and, I, and the pollen was everywhere. I was sneezing like crazy and the pollen it stuck in my eye. And like, I started to get uh, nut allergies. I don't, know, I don't know why, but I started to really, uh, my throat, my ears, my, my nose and my mouth started to get itchy after I ate my butter pecan ice cream from haagen -Dazs. I'm trying to stay away from that. Then I had, they had fruit allergies, peaches, apples, pears, mangoes, kiwis, strawberries. My, my throat would itch as well. My lips would get all tingly. It was a little annoying. <laughs> I really, I really loved, you know, all the fruits, but I just didn't know why. I thought I was a healthy kid just going through and, and just living my life. And somehow my mom, she's the one who made me drink something called Hemo Hem. If you guys don't know what this is, this is our main supplement in Atomy, our flagship product. I didn't want to take it. I didn't want to drink it. I didn't want to do anything with it. It took me like a month to even open this thing up because it smelled like what my grandma used to make when, when I was younger in elementary school and I didn't like it. There's something called like Hanya, something that's like a big juicer thing and it smelled really bad and it smelled just like that. And it was so bitter, that, that Hanya thing. So I thought this is the exact same thing. I didn't want to take it at all, whatever. But my mom, she was so persistent. You know, I know she wasn't going to kill me or I know she wasn't going to do something bad for me. She just wanted to give me some goodness. She wanted to give me everything that's good. So finally, I was like, all right, I'll drink it for you, mom. I didn't care about my allergies. I just drank it because, I, because she told me to. And every day she would call me, if, you know, are you drinking it? Are you drinking it? And yes, mom, I'm my, I'm my second packet. Yep, I'm drinking it. I'm drinking it. Gosh, I'm drinking it. <laughs> but somehow, months later, not even caring, I just drink it every single day, as I was told. I didn't, yeah, I didn't even expect that it would do something to my body. Uh, during the springtime, I was actually outside and enjoying the pollen and playing some tennis, learning how to play tennis, not really good, I mean, especially serving, not so good at that. And pollen was everywhere, all over the court. And for some reason, I wasn't sneezing at all. My other friends, they were, they were still, at home, uh, still at their home. They were sneezing like crazy. They had stuffy noses. They, they, were, they were just taking the medicine still from, you know, from, the, from the university we were going to. And I was completely fine. I was like, oh my gosh, I, I, I'm still playing, I'm still hanging out. They went to a winery too, and, and the tables were filled with, with, pollen, uh, uh, with pollen, and I was still fine. I was telling my friends, like, I'm sniffing in the pollen, everything was good. And I was like, I guess it's because of the heme him. I really don't know. So within like the winter time to the spring time is when I realized maybe it was because of the, the heme him, it helped me out, you know, I'm not really too sure. I, I really didn't care. But thankfully, I graduated with economics. Mm, yeah, I don't do I didn't do anything with economics. I was just, you know what? I'm a, I got my bachelor's, getting into the 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 nine to five world. Maybe I'll get a career in this company or that company. So I jumped job to job while still taking my hemohem. Every single day, I would consistently take hemohem. This is about my ninth year now, and I've not taken any Claritin, no Allegra. No over-the-counter medicine for all my allergies. I eat all the butter pecan ice cream I want, all the peaches, apples, pears, none, none of that. They, it, the hemohem increases my immune system, so it suppresses that tingly feeling, and, and I enjoy it, and even for the pollen. Or I haven't really gotten sick. Or the sneezing-wise this year was okay. It was the sneeze here and there, but it was never with, like, this redness, this constant stuffy nose. 
and and all the people even at like at other the wholesale cup the wholesale stores that you know you walk around and, and people are sneezing and they're grabbing their claritin i'm like man you know i sometimes go there and kind of talk to them too but ah, other than that this is my ninth year taking my hemo ham i'm not saying it cures it but i'm just saying that it helps me out and i hope that people who have allergies uh, they can start taking drinking the hemo ham and you know maybe it can help them i don't know how long it'll take that's what i would say I just drank it because I was told over and over again. So after I graduated economics, I worked at companies here and there. Um, and then somehow my mom was like, hey, come out, come over here and help me out with the seminar here. Help me out with these meetings. And I just like kind of slowly got suckered into it because, you know, she's my mom. I have to help her out in a way. And during the meantime, you know, it, it, she got into this company, you know, of Atomy. And I thought it was a complete pyramid scheme. Network marketing, pyramids, boom. You hear all about it. It's all about pyramids. Even from some of my friends, they were doing some, some selling of these little, these little juice bottles and stuff and, and stuff. thinking about maybe we can try and go sell it at one neighborhood or another neighborhood that's rich over there. Maybe we can make money over, over in that area too. And we thought differently, or he thought differently. And I was just kind of like, all right, let me just try it out. But this network marketing, because Adam was that, I was just like, what are, you, what are you getting into, mom? There's so many things that you're getting into. So many different things, like powder, vegetable powder. I, I had a drink. The toothpaste was green, you know, in, in some companies out there. And even for just different things that were in this home that I just constantly used, and another company comes by. But this one here, I never had my mom actually uh, draw, uh, have the electricity like, cut off, like where they had put an electric, electrical like, device on your home where a guy has to come out and take it off with like, these, these gloves on there. And I'm like, holy cow. Is my mom getting, you know, getting suckered into losing all of her money? What's going on here? But all she was telling me, you know, go on the bank account and just pay for the bills, whatever. She was so focused. That's what it was. I was like, oh my gosh, how is she so focused? I, I know she's doing very well in beautician, you know, doing what she can, but she was so focused because she, she saw something in this company and, and I, I kind of supported a little, little by little. And then I still kind of supported her coming to a seminar and, and trying to read some subtitles of Mr. Uh, the chairman, Mr. Han Gil Park. This guy was, was a cool looking guy. Okay. You know, sometimes at the time he didn't wear a hat. He was just, you know, with a hat list at the time. And I would try and read the subtitles, act like him. And he would read, he would say some, some interesting things that I never really thought about. Not even as, you know, because I'm not an entrepreneur. I wasn't thinking business at all. And he just gave me some interesting points where I'm just in a pool of, of uh, people that compete to make like three, 7,000 a month. And that's called the red ocean. And we think that you have to work in, in the company for so long to gain another position to another position, have many more experiences in the company to get in the higher six figure range. And not many, many of us can do it. Then you talk about the blue ocean where you can get there. It's just people don't, people have, don't have, uh, haven't had the right tool to, to get there, the right opportunity. It's just easier. So, okay, this is pretty interesting. And I really didn't care much of it. Then you know what? Okay, I went to seminars here and there, here and there, and I got a chance, an opportunity to quit my job. Now, I didn't quit my job because I was making good money, getting rich quick, you know, having like all these uh, business partners under me. No, I quit my job to help my mom because there were so many meetings that she had to, uh, she needed help with. She we, she had to drive hours and hours to somewhere. Sometimes we would, we would drive like six hours, uh, six, uh, four or five hours in one spot and come back the same day after all day meetings. And, you know, she, she would do so many things and, and I had to help her out with that. So I quit the job that I was in. It could have been a good pr profession or, or career, a career somewhere, a good, good uh, connection to many others. But you know what? I chose this. To, and so it helped my mom in the business. There's many businesses out there that have family businesses, you know, family restaurants. You have people who, who even have dry cleaners and family, family dry cleaners, or even for accountants, they have family. There's like a four generation accountant, accountant that I know of. And, and it's, it's crazy from a daughter to another daughter to, a, to another daughter. It's, it's insane. So, you know, why not? Why not do this? And I was more comfortable because I was using the products. You know, my skin was going well. My health was doing well too. And when I came to those seminars there, people were saying so much good goodness. And you kind of just like got suckered into it. You know, they were saying all these like, Aja, aja, aja stuff. And I'm like, what is this? Aja, aja, aja. What is all this company model stuff? What, what, what's going on here? What, what am I, what's my mom getting into? And so I support her full on uh, because she was soon going to try and drop her scissors and drop her, her 20 year profession and like making very good money, almost like six figures cat, uh, six figures in a way 
cutting, cutting, cutting hair and doing all these perms and all these magic perms. And I'd be there sweeping the hair. Either way, I was always backed up with her on whatever she did. And I backed up her one more time. So what this Atomy is here, Atomy, if we just need to know, we're not here to sell products. We can. That's kind of what we, we need to do because nobody knows about it. So what in the world can this company do for all of us? You know, we are here to use these products here and we're just trying to tell things. And, and people can, uh, can purchase more products and try to make a sale. Yes, uh, I did the exact same thing. But what we need to understand is these brands, these companies, we've been doing it all for so long. If, you got, if you're a network marketer on here, maybe for a few years now, or maybe a decade or over a couple of decades, this company is completely changed the history, has completely changed the history of network marketing. It's a store, but it's also network marketing. It's a, it's a store, but it's also business. It's all online as well too, and internationally connected into something very big. These brands here that we normally use it five years ago, 20 years ago, whatever years ago, you used at least two or three of these brands and it's in your house. Hopefully it's all out of me now, but it's in your house and you've used it. But we never really thought about getting money back. We never really thought about doing business for this brand, doing business for this, this type of brand over here and there, what we use every single day. But then again, there's even the, what we have to pay for a higher quality. And yes, we all know it. I'm guilty of it too. We pay for our quality, no matter what. This store, Atomy, finally has changed that where we can gain the quality and we can receive a very low price, a convenient price, a competitive price. A, what we call it, of course, absolute quality and absolute price. Do not forget that. It's the principle of Atomy. It has never changed in the past 11 years, since 2009 until now, They've kept their quality at top. They kept it super high up and they called it absolute quality. And then they called the competitive pricing absolute price. Where this, pro this product here can be sold through Atomy, extremely high quality and low price for a consumer like you and me, then we can buy. No matter what, even if we don't do the business, even if I didn't do this business at all, at all I would still drink my hemohem because it helps me with my allergies. And I figured that out you know, after the symptoms were suppressed. And my skincare, and I've been using this thing and it brightens it up and people ask me what I'm using and you still get ID'd at the bar and blah, 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 blah. <laughs> what this is doing has changed something where you have to realize, okay, there is a store here. It's, it's a brand that we can use every single day, over 20 different items that we at least use every single day. And then we can get money back. But with this store here, this brand here of Atomy is our distribution channel, providing us our absolute quality, absolute price, and also distributing out profits, profits and commissions that from the company, not from the people. Because we think about that and, and doing business, we, want, we think about, okay, how much can I make off of this or off of that? And we, if we think business that way, but if we just think about if we're all using the same pricing, if, either if you joined yesterday, joined three months ago or three years ago, or even uh, 10 years ago, we all receive the same price here in America. That's just so cool. And people in other companies out there, they think that, you know, we're making money or making commission off of other people or off of each other. And we have to realize these prices in the product, they took out all the commissions off of what people would make. And they brought down the pricing of the product. So every single one of us can receive such a low price. When I, when I got to these seminars, that's when I started realizing, okay, we got this thing, but how in the heck can we make money? what's going on, how do we make money, you know, this, the products are so low, they're so good quality, and if everyone received the same price, how are we gonna make the money? Well, of course, there's points involved. But when it came to these seminars, and just like we heard today for these testimonies here today too, they got the product from somewhere. They got the product from, a, uh, from, from someone, or they actually joined a, member from, joined a member through someone, and then they bought it online too. But when they used it, that's when it's something different. So when it came to these seminars back when before COVID, for, for many years, um, they were saying, people who were using, who were giving testimonies or the ones who were successful, they, they actually received the product or they sold one and they used it. So I did the same. I got, I, I got into, uh, I got products. You know, I got a bunch of products, not my funds, my mom's funds. I got a bunch of these products and I went out there and I sold it. I sold it, but not with commission, not with, not with you know, trying to make profits, not trying to make little chump change. I, I sold it to consumers at the price, as a member's price. I try to get them to become a member as, as much as I can, you know, as far as I can to just get them to become a member, last for social, they didn't want to give it, come on, just let me try, do something. And then, then they kind of gave in because they kind of trusted me to try it out. But here, because I had a product in my hand to try to receive to a consumer, 
you know, I would go there to, I would go to nail salons, I go to hair salons, you know, uh, beauty salons, of course, uh, dry cleaners, to some other stores as well, too. And I, or even someone walking across the street kind of limping as well. And you would think maybe there's something wrong with his leg and you want to help out. Maybe this product here, maybe the Omega-3 could help out. I learned these things through a bunch of testimonies I heard over and over and over again. And I gained consumers. I'd find they, some, sometimes I get kicked out. Sometimes I would, I would actually be trusted because the skin was, looked so good because, I, because of the product. And then I tried to, to show them how to use a skincare. And from these little facial events, you know, I, I told them, you know what, I don't have a license, but can I touch your face? Because I know how to use it on myself very well and I want to teach you. Then I, then I would show them more of the products, more of Adam's products, from the toothbrush, the toothpaste, to, the, to down into the, the hemohem, you know, explaining about it. And how did I do that? I was never in college. I never took public speaking. I hated talking in front of people. I'm sweating right now. You know, and I'm like, I, I, would, I would talk about a summary of a book and I would, I would curse because I messed up and I'm like, oh my, God. I'm not gonna say it here, but you know what I'm saying? I get so nervous and I wasn't good at that. But because my mom needed my help over and over again, in front of like two people, I had to talk about chemo and the skincare. I would write a PowerPoint, which I haven't used in forever. I write a whole paragraph and read that sucker on the screen and just pretend I know what I'm talking about. I just read the whole thing. And because I did it over and over again, it just, it just kind of got into me. Okay, maybe I can shrink down this information, shrink out th this information. And I realized I, I don't have to say everything at one time. And because I said it, oh, and I had it in my head over and over again. Okay, I would talk about a little bit of this, a little bit of that, so they get them interested. Because once they're interested, they could be hooked. Yes, it sounds like we're brainwashing them, but it's for the good because we're not making money off the people. We're trying to introduce them. We are the brand users. We are the ones who are advertising ourselves to trust Atomy because Atomy is quite trustworthy and we've seen it right now. So as I got these consumers, I went through their consumers and their contacts because my friends, they thought I was trying to do this business and trying to sell things. But whenever someone opens up like a, cook, like a, like a, um, like a yogurt shop, they would all go there. But when someone's trying to do some network marketing, they would stay away from all that. So here I am trying to introduce more. I, I, I even got a peeling gel. I went to the store, got a peeling gel, did some of that, got this gentleman over here, show, show him how to do this thing and, and create a facial. And, and through the consumers, I work with more consumers over and over again. But what you must understand, you have to follow up very, very well. Or else, like me, you're going to have a lot of people who are expired. You forget to go back to the ones that you actually first talk with, back to the people that you really need to talk with who, are, who actually like the product and want to, share, want to know more. And, 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 and that's where I had many mistakes in. And with mistakes, I was able to try to overcome that. So with these here, um, these mistakes that I have done is a follow-up process. Now, I had tried to you know, talk to them more and more, and many of them said no. Many of them say, oh, I'm okay with toothbrushes. Oh, you know what? I, I don't need I don't need any, any more of that. I, I don't need any more of uh, um, detergents and stuff. And, and so I I would get locked out, and what you know I would be dry on my more memberships, on more consumers, and more and because consumers to buy something you get points, right? And the points accumulate, and the points will match up for some commission from the company, right? And that's when okay, I have to really try and find more people or work with their contacts, more co just one by one. Do you know one person? Do you know one person? Maybe who may be interested in toothbrushes, maybe who brush their teeth, who shampoo, or maybe who, who has some sort of allergies. Maybe we talk about the hemohem, maybe it can help them, or maybe they could be interested that way, or maybe they want a different type of shampoo or something herbal, a shampoo, or maybe they want the vitamin C. There's so many things and so many opportunities, so many different ways and routes we can try and get a consumer to try out Atomy. We can try to make this brand because we try, what we're trying to do is to change their household into using Atomy. And, then we want to show them there's more to it. There's meetings. Maybe we can invite them to a meeting and to show them something just like this here. Now, we don't want to bring someone in and, and you know, just bombard them with like, you know what, you can do business, you can do all this. And, and you, that's what I did was I went to the consumer, the product first, and I made them to become a loyal consumer. Even if they don't want to do the business, I make sure that they actually enjoy the products because without them trusting the product, they're not going to think about anything further. And then, and people who, who thought business right away, I cut them off and say, you know what? You got to try these products first. If you don't, you're, you're not going to understand how good these are and how low prices these are. And without your experience, you're not going to talk about it. You're only going to talk about business. So there are people who are still doing business as well too, but I still try and talk to them. You know what? 
have you tried to heal him? When's the last time you ate it? When's the last time you tried the vitamin C? Or, oh, I haven't got the avocado oil yet, or I haven't gotten this. You still want to have the people who are doing the business or thinking business, but still aren't, aren't really like consuming all the products yet. You still want to try and uh, realize that person needs to become a full anime user. But before that person, it's always going to be yourself. Because I made sure I used that skincare like crazy. I made sure I brushed my teeth two times, three times a day. I made sure I shampooed the heck out of my head with the herbal shampoo before. And now with the other products that we have too as well. I made sure I was the brand user because I could be more confident and to tell more people, this is actually really good. You want to try this one out. Maybe show them a little bit of things that could be you know, offered. And nowadays people talk about ingredients. I didn't go with ingredients. I just said what the benefits were and how I felt. And maybe you could feel the same and compare them to what other brands were. But try and bring them into a system, right? We always talk about, there's, if you heard about this, we've always talked about a system over and over again. What exactly is a system? Because I went to, uh, because I, I went to so many meetings for my mom over and over again, and I experienced actually trying to cold call and try to sell the product, but not make the commission, not make, not make it uh, a profit off of people. Because I did this process here, before I even went out there, I had to understand and I had to really show, uh, really understand some of the product information. Within that, that comes from the meetings. And from the meetings came from testimonies. And from testimonies, it, it brought uh, to our minds, we can share more things, but also this is a business. We can make money and we actually become successful because of the people I saw before, there were actually so many out there from Korea. And before, uh, they, came, they were flying to Korea, uh, fly from Korea uh, and show their experience, show their vision. And that turned into these seminars. Every single month, uh, except every quarter, every month, what I had the opportunity to do, not everyone here has done it, and many of us have here, uh, but ones who, who don't understand this yet, basically what, what I did was, with my mother, we would travel uh, about a week to about five, six different cities, and from North Carolina, South Carolina, uh, Atlanta, and sometimes Florida as well too, we would drive these areas, and she would do this before I did, but I kind of had the opportunity to do it, and I would see Jason Shim. If you guys know Jason Shim, he would come down here all the time. And I met him as a dime master too. That, yep, dime master. And he was down here doing all these cores and mics and stuff and having the projector screen up. And he was on the computer doing almost the whole shebang, the whole show. And somehow I got the opportunity. Luckily, I became the person to do that. <laughs> I was the one doing the computer, talking about the products. Sometimes I was the host. Hello, my name is Martin Hahn. Nice to meet you. I'll be your host for today. And see, and the company motto, and just do the whole thing. Sometimes I do the product presentation over and over again, too. But at the end, the vision speaker, and it all started with, I believe it started with uh, Mee Young Park here, the lady in the middle. The one in the blue, that's my mother, and that's me on the right, and her husband on the left, and Jason Shim on the right as well, too. He's a roadmaster now. In the middle, Mee Young, uh, Miss Mee Young Park, she was a roadmaster, now she's a crown master, which is pretty cool. It all started from here that I realized, okay, it's not just about the business, it's about the money. But we connected to, to, to friends. And I became friends with her. Uh, and whenever I go to Korea, I always see her. And she's like, oh, you know, you know good to see you again. And I, I understood that, okay, it's actually a different connection that brings together a people, I guess, close by or across the world. And then I, for a whole week, I, I would understand, or I would kind of get to know them and, uh, to, a, to a different level and to see where they came from and how Ami has changed their life. Not only here, but for the past four, almost five years, I went to hundreds of seminars, almost like 200 seminars every single month. I would go there. We would travel for a week to many different places. These are just a few, few pictures, but I have a bunch of pictures out there. And I would just, uh, I experienced so much because I understood from these seminars here, I understood that I had to, under, uh, I had to know the system. What exactly is a system? Well, it's basically talking about the products. It's about experiencing the product, talking about it, sharing about it. And if anybody had, had, um, had any problems with it, if anybody had any questions about the business side too, I would be the one to, to have them, to share with them. And because, you know, I had to study it. I had to, because I did it over and over again. It just became like, like a habit in a way. You know, things, whenever I talk to friends or I talk to people and stuff, for some reason, I just talk about, I think about anatomy in a way. Oh man, I've got sick here and there. Emo hair, vitamin C. Oh man, my, my clothes smell like this. Uh, our, dis, our detergent. Oh, you know, I, you know, um, the, the, the dis detergent made my hands always dry. I'm like, ah, should I talk about the dis detergent now or kind of like bring it up later? Like, I would, it would come up over and over again. It just, oh, it's in my head. I can't get out of it. Even for Saturdays, just like now, you know, I'll be out there and it was a friend. I, I should be out there with friends, but at the time, and still now too, 
And basically, I had put my time into anatomy instead of being invited to, to football game meetings or, or to, to, um, to dinners or this and that. I put my time into anatomy because it's kind of what I got stuck into. Now, <laughs> so the cool part is about this here, uh, I actually met someone, you know, if you guys know Nick Cannon, they're traveling so much. I met this guy too, Nick Cannon. It was kind of a fun little thing at, at the end too. But um, my experience here was definitely very fun. So I miss these seminars so much here. Lucky for you guys, don't have to drive to these places. And to these seminars, it was free for anyone to attend. And I would do it so much and see the same person or, or new people here and there. They thought I was the employee of Atomy. I'm like, no, 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 no. I'm a member just like you. I'm not an employee. And they're like, you know, what? how do I get a job here? You know, can I be like just the, the technical guy like you? I'm like, okay, I'm, I know I'm a tech guy, but I'm part of Atomy. I'm trying to do a seminar for you. So you can see something or at least you brought your mom or your dad into your life too. And like, they, it's still different from what I, what I experienced through Atomy. And I, I miss it. I miss it a lot. From all this traveling, meeting people over and over again, actually human contact, you know. Um, but for you guys, luckily, we have it on these meetings. Whether you have it on your phone, your tablet, your computer, wherever you are, you can do this thing. Because before, you had to go to them. And over there in New Jersey, if you guys are over there, or New York, I had to fly. I, I, I flew over there one time, too. And it was different. It was good because you experienced different seminars with different people. Uh, because I had one system this way, and they have it that way. And I experienced so many more others, uh, so many other seminars out there. And I thought about, you know what, maybe many people, you know, really should understand this. That's, that's what we have to understand. We have to understand we need to know the system. We need to know the products. We have to understand what anatomy is. We have to understand what we're getting into because this company is not just for a couple of years. You know, I quit my job five years ago, and, and I'm just now getting started. We're all just now getting started. You know, if five years later, 10 years later, we're still going to think about Atomy because we're now, we're now using it. No matter what, you're still going to use Atomy because if you use something else, like the toothpaste out there, again, different brands, or the other detergent, you're going to revert right back into Atomy. You're, you're, you're a brand user now. Now with this, why not make the money? Why not do some business? Well, why not? Let's just make 2000 a month. Let's make 8000 a month. Let's make the $30,000 a month that I saw in, in my own eyes with these people that come from Korea and they're traveling here and because they create a system they duplicated the system under them. You know, they duplicated that so that it could keep on, uh, keep on going. And they can go anywhere. Not saying you're, you know, yeah, you're making money from the company, not from the people. And that's what, that's what I really, really liked. And within these seminars, I try to invite people over and over and over again. You know, I would talk about products in front of people that, that you know, I, I didn't even invite, or I invited, but they didn't even come. Yeah, I'll be there. You know, yeah, 6 p.m. Oh, great. 6.30? Oh, yeah, yeah, no problem. I'll be right after dinner. It's like 9.30 and they're still not there. Or I, I try to invite them to, to, a, cent, to a center meeting, you know, just, just a one-on-one. -on -one and, you know, it'd be really good. Yes, it could be the potential to talk about chemo him, maybe the business. I don't know. Yep. Another one doesn't even come. Over and over again, so many people have not come, no show, over and over again. I even bought pizza, two large pizzas, because these guys were big guys. <laughs> and so a couple of people, two large pizzas from Papa John's. Let's cut that out. Two large pizzas from, from, from the store. And I ate almost half of the other one. Like, it's just like, oh, why are these people coming? Because they don't know. They don't know how good these seminars are. They don't know how good Atomy is. They don't understand how good this is for their future, for their future, for their future's future, and their generations to come. And it's just a time, just with time, and just with some luck as well, too. But in these seminars, in these seminars, when we do invite someone, finally, this person came. This person brought a friend because they thought, you know, it's just like some sort of cult and coming into this thing and it's a free, like what's going on here. But luckily, there are some testimonies. Luckily, there are other people talking about their experience or what they like about the product or what they like about the company. Different things, different minds. And they catch some little, they hear some, some things, some little details that they wanted to hear before. And because maybe you can't say everything all at one time. Maybe you can't do that. But someone else, if they hear, if they hear something at, at one time, uh, a little bit of, of like, oh, that helps them with allergies. Oh, that's for the skincare. Oh, man. Actually, you know, listening to this person here, I, maybe I'll try this toothbrush out. It's something that where we, they will hear something um, that they want to hear, little by little, because finally are these testimonies. Great. That's very good, too, from, these, from the seminars. And also, when we invite people here, I'm not successful yet. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. I'm a Sharon Rose master. Yes, I'm on my way just like you guys. And just like the star master here too, in the leaders, in, in leadership, it's great. It's really, really great. And, and so what we can do here and realize, you know what? We can get there as well too. We see people there. They talk about their experience. 
Some of them have never been in network marketing. They've been in different professions like create like in it for a very long time and they get into Atomy, sometimes even part-time or, or jumping into full-time because they are so focused. Even my mom too, like so focused. And, and what, when we see for the other successful people or others who join in on here and they see that, maybe they realize, you know what, maybe I can do it too. And I've heard that many, many times where, where one grandpa was like, you know what, that one grandma over there, this was in Korea too, in Korean. That one grandma over there is actually, um, you know, that became, they became a dime master. They can do it. Maybe I can do it too. That person is even older than me. That maybe I can get there as well. People bring in different people and they realize from these seminars, they hear something very, that they, that's what they want to hear. That's what's so good about this. So coming into this system, coming to seminars and meetings is what I realized, man, I have to keep on bringing people over and over again. Not only that, if they don't show, I still showed no matter what. I never missed a seminar in the past four years. I went to every single one of them, never missed it. Even if I was sick or if I was you know, kind of coughing here and there, or if I didn't want to, if I really didn't want to go, I still had to go because it was my business because I, I, I'm in anatomy, you know, if, even if friends invite me, invite me for a barbecue or this and that, I would still go to a seminar because it is a pinpoint and an appointment that we must attend just for a couple of hours of our time. Also, there are many times where my friends were trying to get me into their business or trying to say, Hey, come over and work over here. You'll make six figures in like two years, man. Just, just work hard and, you, and you'll get there. You know, why, why, why not do that? But with all these little things that try to drag me out of this business, trying to make, make this business back to part-time, I almost got, re, uh, you know, got drawn out. But coming back to these seminars and hearing the people who, were, who um, helped, them with their, helped them with their health, helped them with their, to really realize how great this company is, listen to our CEO's video, listening to the vision speakers and, and how powerful it is, it got me thinking back into, okay, I got to do anatomy. I can't stop. I had to focus on this thing. It's only a matter of time. It's inevitable where I cannot succeed in this business because we have that uh, limited levels over and over again. And I was never in network marketing before. This is my first one to really see the lineage and, and see left and right, left and right in, in, in a binary system. And within this year, uh, for me, I thought about, okay, unlimited customers, not unlimited um, people and members. Members. Because each person, no matter what, if, even if they are doing business or not, they're still a customer. So I thought about, we must have this as unlimited customers and to try and get them into the system, into the seminars to really try and duplicate this because all the people out there, they're not going to see it. These, these friends I had, they're not going to see and understand what really truly it is because they still didn't want to come in. There's so many friends out there that, that want to try and add me. So I can't wait until my success is there. A little bit more, just a little bit more. And once you get to a spot, then you want a little bit more. And once you get to another spot, you want a little bit more over and over again. And we've all come together here. We have over what? Over 45 people here. It was, it was actually a little more earlier. Sorry, I, I guess they dropped out because of me. But <laughs> we got it all together here and we see how powerful it is. We see, right now we see faces before we actually was able to like give handshakes, give hugs, high five, take pictures of stuff. But we're all here virtually because that's what we got into. That's how the society is turning into and that's what we should do. That's how powerful it should be. When we invite people in here, we always want you to be happy and we always see the happiness. And I'm so thankful to be in this type of meeting here and, and to be invited and to be thought of about. You know, thank you, um, Daniel from Thank you for, for thinking of me. You know, I, I really appreciate that. And, and it's just, it's a, great, it's a great opportunity. And no matter if any of, us on, any of us on here has never spoken on here at all, do it. Because I had to do it over and over again. I'm not that speaker. I had to do this over and over again, you know. So I'm just kind of talking because I've been doing it for so long. For just, you know, half a decade. So I'm going to go on for more decade, decades longer because we're not used to it at all. If we speak more, the more we talk, the more we think about it, the more, the more we study it, the more, the, more, the, more, the more we do something over and over again, not just thinking it, then that's when good things will happen. That's when our stuff will change. Uh, and, and I really experienced that myself. So... The opportunities have come into uh, greatness. You know, I, I, I had, to, uh, had the opportunity to, to opportunity to present in different states, different cities, and also even different countries as well too. And I wish that this COVID didn't come through. I was able to get to a different country overseas. They would invite me over there to speak over and over again, you know, uh, to speak because I was so used to this thing. And darn it, this COVID went through. So if anyone's on here, it's actually, I mean, we can virtually go somewhere. You know, wherever you guys are in different states, I'm here in North Carolina, we're all in different states, all at one time, or maybe in a different country too. This is what we bring in uh, in saving time. Just save time. That's what happens. Uh, just, to, just to let you guys know. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Just quickly, briefly, 
this is the main thing that we must do. I kind of went ahead of myself. This is the main thing that we must do and must realize we need to duplicate it over and over again. Some of us might think sales master is something small, but it's a stepping stone. The very first thing we must try and get to is to try and get sales. We have to get sales and consumers, and we must do this. But once you grow it, once you do grow it, if you, and, and, and you actually follow up with the consumers over and over again, and you grow it, and you might try and push yourself to do a little further, there's something called a sales master, and we, this is where the incentives are, the bonuses, the cash bonus. Yes, we can get some points of 300,000 points here, 300,000 points there, but when we do this here, we get a little more bonuses. And then when we duplicate this, we get a little extra bonus as well too. So we have the first to 15th or 16th end of the month as the bonus. And I, I didn't really understand. I just thought it was just points. I thought it was just 2,500,000 points on the left and right hand side. And I need to become a special agent. Now I get products. But what next? You know, do I get my $2,000 a month? And that's what I thought about. And you know, where's my 2,000? Oh, it's these consumers that must, that you mean must maintain because it's this brand. If they don't use it over and over again, which I, my follow-up process was terrible on, on, and I had to realize, oh, get back in, write in my notebook. Maybe I, I can try to follow up, follow up with them. You know, whenever they lost, uh, they're, they're finished with chemo him, when they bought it, how much they bought it for, and to do this little process so that the consumers will build up and build up. But then, and then we can maybe, if there's points that need to be filled in, I, I need some more chemo him, I purchased some more chemo him. I need more skincare, I purchased more skincare because the points need to be there too. With this very first stepping stone, without this here, we will never get to the next levels. And we, ne we will never get to the very last one. It's called the Imperial Master, right? We won't even get there if we don't really truly understand this. By doing this, though, it's not just trying to do 2.5 2 million points on, one, uh, on both sides, like one time. I understood, I, I tried to uh, hear from others that there's something called Auto Sales Master. When we do it like twice a month or once a month or something what, uh, over and over again. And because I was trying to push myself to do that, I was able to get into, uh, I was actually able to try and show and understand that there were auto consumers. With auto consumers, basically, we just want, I want to let you know, they're just members purchasing automatically without you trying. With that, them, they have their account information, they go online and they purchase on their own and they consume over and over again. But before they do that, we must try and let them know, let you, I must try and let you know you must become that consumer first. You must consume all these things. And like I said, from head to toe, inside and out, I am a brand user myself of Atomy. No matter what, I will use Atomy's brand. Well, not this brand of toothbrushes, that brand of toothbrushes, I would use Atomy. Now getting into this here, the auto sales master, what we must do over and over again, and we, we should try and do this, right? The ones who don't know this, you'll, you'll understand. But basically we have must follow up with calling, messaging, I had called people over and over again. Some people thanked me because they were out of chemo him, and thankfully I had called them because they needed some more, and I'd be, that, I'd be that person. Now, we all don't have to do this, but it's just another way, another route to do as well, too. Or, but nowadays, we can't really see them, so message them, call them, and if you do see them, of course, wear that mask, right, six feet apart. Uh, then we want, we want to learn and order, uh, learn how to order, learn how to register uh, members as well, too, and teach them over and over again, each person, do not just go over one person. Oh, this person only just wants toothbrushes or just this and that. We must try to focus to, to tell them 10 times. If you tell them 10 times, as we heard from our CEO, Mr. Hangyo Park, that's going to be one time. And we must do that over and over again. Like my mom was persistent on my hemo him. That's when I gave in. That's when I completely gave in. Then we want to personally invite them into these meetings here, into these seminars, because it's really important, no matter what. It really is. And without, without them coming, don't be discouraged. I definitely was, but I realized, okay, n n next person, next person. Invite him over and over again. New people, great, but go back to the person you invited again from before. Uh, that duplication process is the main thing we must do, but before this, we must understand the system. If we do Auto Sales Master over and over again, you know, uh, 12 times within a year, we get to go to the Auto Sales Master workshop. Before, we actually gathered together over there in New Jersey, in Seattle, even in L.A. L.A. is the one I went to as well. Too. Uh, New Jersey is the one I went to, and L.A. as well. As well. Um, and I was, it, was different. it was a very different workshop. It's not like a title or anything. It's just something where you accomplish. And, yes, we get like a jacket. We get great gifts. The company does really well. But also, you see many others from America that can gather together who are also all sales masters, the ones who are constantly accumulating 
2,500,000 PV at least once a month over and over again, um, and you qualified to come here. This is delayed for now. Sorry to say, it's delayed for now, but it was a great time here, you know, to see many more people. Some of this was this was LA, uh, the last one here, and maybe we might see some people that you've seen before on the call. And those jackets are pretty cool. But hopefully, if you can though, uh, try to to maintain your auto sales auto sales master and do that because then that's when it feels good. But also duplicating this will gain you another mastership or even more income. Now, what I see personally. Just almost finishing up here. I, I, what I see personally is the Diamond Master, Jason Stint, at the time is when I met him. And now I saw him, I, I saw him become a Sharon Rose Master, a Star Master, and even towards a Royal Master, which is really cool as well, too. And there's only a couple, a few in America. And I met him when he was just at, at the beginning of it. And for someone who lives with me, or who I live with, you know, my, my mom who gave me birth, just a single mom. Single mom working her butt off her entire life, finally accomplishing a fourth level of Star Master. And, she, and it's, it's great. It really is. So I understood that she, I, did, I quit my job for her to get into this. So while I was in here, might as well try to make, make my time worth it, right? So I got, uh, I got into my master. It took a little bit longer, but I really wish I, I, get, I can get that $2,000 know, bonus as a share in a row because I saw them. And I really wanted it. I really did. It took me like four years to do this thing. But with these promotions, I finally became a Sharon Rose Master last year, and yes, I, I want to keep on going. I want to do this thing. There's only, there's only um, uh, myself and, and uh, one other, I remember Julie Kim, Sharon Rose Master. We are the two youngest, no, she's the youngest one in America. I'm still trying to be there as well. As a 30-year-old, ah, just trying to be one of the youngest in America, but well, we'll, we'll see. <laughs> so I just took a little bit longer time. Some people took it faster. It's, it's only a matter of time. Anatomy is, is not a race. It's a marathon to get there and to get to a position that you want. You know, yes, Imperial Master is the spot. That's the key as well, yes. But there's steps that we must take to try and gain our own success. And with the, success, with the promotions and stuff, with the master trips, I was able to go to the, um, the, Sharon, the, the Sharon Rose master trip my, with my mom and, and the Hawaii one, uh, Hawaii, no, Cancun and Hawaii. And with my master trip, the promotion tickets, I can't wait until this thing kind of suppresses down so I can try, so we can all, all the Sharon Rose Masters uh, can, can go to the, Shan, the Cancun or the Bahamas. I just can't wait to be my, finally it would be my own, my turn to, uh, to, bring, uh, to bring myself. And, you know, extra tickets could, could be someone uh, to come along with as well, too. So with this online system, work with this thing here. You have to travel anywhere, you're at your home, wherever you are, we're all on in the system. Because of this code, if you go over here, We'll beat it. it it'll, 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 it's going to linger around anyway. And we might as well use this online system. We have this here and we can utilize as much as we can. Uh, so let me get to this part here. We are, all able to, we are all able to succeed no matter what. It is only a matter of time. Persistence over and over again. With, this, with the time and persistence, it's inevitable for any of us, each and every one of us, to succeed. And whether it's a sales mastership, or even, or even uh, having better skin, or even having, you know, um, helping with your health, something is gonna, is gonna make you realize anatomy is there. Anatomy, anatomy is my stepping stone, my opportunity, my key to be in a road of success, to be in, 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 you know, getting towards that. And anatomy has that system. And we're all in the system, we're all in it together. And if you haven't realized, you know, that anatomy is a great opportunity, there's many more other types of income out there, the residual income that we need, but anatomy is, that e is the easy, Easy way, really is. It's just a matter of time and, and, and just being, you know, just not really quitting. Quitting is just not brushing your teeth with the, with the products or not, not using the products at all. That's, that's quitting. If you don't use the products, then you're quitting. Business-wise, it's up to you. That's, that's totally up to you because there's stores out there that can give cash back, but not as much as our, uh, as Atomy, giving us back $1.2 million in a year. That's insane. Or even $10,000 a month or even $15,000 or just $4,000 a month, just as extra side income. That could be something where all of us uh, could really get to. And I hope that you have uh, not slept through my presentation here today. I hope maybe you saw something that, you could, that could help you in your business. Hopefully that it can uh, for, for your next mastership or for your next you know, member to join or just to, sh to share with. Just to know, you must understand, I must understand what Atomy is about. I must understand the company, products, the business side, and maybe show something and you experience yourself as well too. I really appreciate each one of you guys for listening today. And, and to let you guys know, my name is Martin Hahn. I'm currently a Sharon Rose Master. And I'll see you guys in your next mastership.
Thank you so much for listening, everyone. Wow, we can really enjoy his passion, can't we? I know I sure did. And this is like the third time I've listened to Martin talk. But each time, I'm always learning something new. Even though I've heard it before, I'm learning it like it's for the first time. The eyes are open. The ears are open. Thank you, Martin. Let's give him another one.